Oh my God, what a question. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, I got to tell you about. Edgar, thank you very much for the interview. Hey. So I have these uh, questions. Uh, I understand that you eat a lot of press junkets, but these questions are made by musicians. Ah, I'm always up for different questions. The who asks, who are you? <laughs> the who, who are you? Uh, I am like um, a, an English film director, writer, director. And I guess uh, uh, with each kind of like film, I get to travel around the world more and work in different places. So that's something that I'm really proud of is uh, being British and growing up in like a small town in England and getting to sort of travel the world, making movies and promoting them. It's pretty amazing. Nirvana asks, where did you sleep last night? Tell me when did you sleep last night? <laughs> um, I'm not sure Nirvana would uh, think it was, uh, that is probably not a cool enough answer to say the Ritz-Carlton, Mexico City. <laughs> ACDC asks, what do you do for money, honey? <laughs> uh, I, what do I do for money, honey? I, um, I write and direct movies. I'm very lucky that I get to do my uh, passion and my hobby as a career. And I try to always remember how fortunate I am. Bahamen, who let the dogs out? Who let the dogs out? Um, somebody, somebody asked me the other day if they could come up with a, uh, the movie of like Who Let the Dogs Out and I said Act 1 is establishing that the dogs are in, Act 2 is that the dogs are out and Act 3 is solving the riddle of Who Let the Dogs Out and that would be the Who Let the Dogs Out movie. But I don't have any pets so I definitely did not let the dogs out. Travis asks, why does it always rain on me? Why does it Ah, because I'm from England and so whenever I travel to a country and it's bad weather people say oh you've brought the British weather with you so that happens quite a lot I see it's raining now so I've, I've done that Pink Floyd is there anybody out there is there anybody out there <laughs> well is there anybody out there here's the thing um, one of the nice things about doing this movie is that you make any movie you have no idea how it's going to do and even like four weeks ago just before this movie opened in the States I was very anxious I had no idea how it was going to do and I'm so very happy that there were people out there and that they came to see the movie and that means everything to me. Uh, David Bowie, is there life on Mars? Is there life on Mars? I would like to think that there is life on Mars. I mean, I think pretty much they've found sort of um, some evidence of that. So I'm going to say, yes, there is life on Mars. Six Pistols, uh, who killed Bambi? Who killed Bambi? Who killed Bambi? Um, who killed Bambi? Uh, it was, uh, well, in the Disney film, it's a hunter, right? It's man, man killed Bambi. Um, yeah, so I say man. Uh, the Bee Gees, how deep is your love? How deep is your love? Is your love how deep is your love? <laughs> uh, I'd like to think it was reasonably deep. I mean, I'd like very, I very like, ro I'd like to say I'm a romantic person, so I'd say my, my love is, is, is quite deep. But Tina Turner asks, what's love got to do with it? <laughs> I think love has everything to do with it. I think so. I think one of the things with this movie is that people really respond to the romantic uh, story in it. So I think that's something that um, I've seen people seem to really connect with. Uh, another tricky one. Barry Mann asks, "Who put the bump in the bump, the bump, the bump?" Who put the bump in the bump, the bump, the bump? Who put the rhyme in the ramalama ding dong? 
I'm not sure. I think probably it was the same person who let the dogs out. Frank Zappa have, uh, has two questions. What's the ugliest part of your body? What's the ugliest part of your body? Oh my God, what a question. I, I'm not sure, I, I mean, uh, like, I, I don't even know where to start, so like, uh, I'm about to skip that one. Oh, and Frank Zappa, why does it hurt when I pee? Why does it hurt when I pee? <laughs> you probably got cystitis or something. War, why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? I think we should be friends. I think sort of like, um, I mean, um, well, they've answered their own question in a way because like, if, why can't we be friends is usually because we're at war. So maybe like they would be better friends if they didn't call the band war. Uh, Colter Club, do you really want to hurt me? Do you really want to hurt me? I would never want to hurt anybody. So I apologize if anybody has been uh, I, I've hurt anybody over the years, especially Boy George. Uh, the cure, why can't I be you? <laughs> why can't I be you? Um, <laughs> that's a very good question. I mean, there's no reason, there's no reason that you can't. Well, I say this, lots of people ask me about how to become a film director. And one thing I'd say is like, there is nothing stopping you from making movies. You don't need to have money, you know, you don't need to know anybody. There is nothing stopping you from making movies, so there's no reason why you can't be me. The Offspring, why don't you get a job? Anna, why don't you get a job? <laughs> uh, I mean, a lot of people would say that what I do isn't the proper job, um, but I do work very, very hard, even though I, I, I'm fully aware that it's not like um, the worst job in the world. And the biggest, where's my man? Well, that's a good one because I am incredibly jet lagged because in the last seven days, I've been in like Asia, um, Brazil, and now Mexico. So I don't know what even time zone my mind is on right now. So I have no idea to answer the pixies. Well, thank you very much, Edgar. And my last question will be, should I stay or should I go? Should I stay or should I go? I think the clash say that the time is up and you gotta go, so. Only because the clash say so, but I think you gotta go, I'm sorry. That's my baby.